China is marking its first National Poverty Relief Day. Beijing says it lifted around 660 million people out of poverty from 1978 to 2010. However, poverty relief is still a challenging mission. CCTV's Guan Yang has the story. Before dawn each morning, Chen Shijie needs to get to work before the rest of the city. While most people are still in slumber, he sweeps litter of the streets before the rush hour begins. Laid off in 2001 from a large state-owned enterprise, the 41-year-old now makes barely enough to get by. I start working at 4.30 a.m. every day. My duty is to look after this 500-meter-long street for eight hours a day. I've also taken a part-time job in the evenings to make some extra cash. My total income is about 1,700 yuan per month. This job is the hardest during cold winter days. 1,700 yuan, or about 280 U.S. dollars per month, is the breadwinning income for himself, his wife who suffers from uremia, and their 14-year-old daughter. It's been 10 years since the family ate out for dinner, an outing captured in memory by this photo. Living in austerity, daughter Jian Nan hopes more for herself and others in need. Someday, when I grow up, my dream is to open a hospital to treat patients like my mom and to ease their pain. For now, the family is still struggling. Though the country's improved health care insurance system has helped them foot most medical bills, living on a shoestring budget has brought an emotional toll. Sometimes I try not to think about what happened to my family because of my work. The thought of the tragedy brings me to tears. All I can do is stay strong and face reality. I feel sorry for my daughter who has sacrificed so much for a girl of her age. With a limited skill set, Chen says it's almost impossible for him to land a job with a decent income. His poverty price isn't unique in China. According to The Lancet, nearly 13 percent of Chinese households are burdened with catastrophic levels of health expenditure, even with the assistance of the social insurers. The growing gap between the rich and poor is seen in a number of countries which are widely considered to be prosperous. In China, for millions of urban dwellers under the poverty line like Chen Shijie, the benefits of the country's growth have yet to trickle down to the people who need it the most. Guoyang, CCTV, Shenyang, Liaoning Province.